Hey guys, welcome back to NFT Inspo. For today's video, we are going to show you or discuss with you AOC CEU 34 G2X best settings. So if you're interested, let's start the tutorial. Now you might be wondering what is the best settings here that you could set for your AOC monitor. Well, there's a few suggestions that you could try here, but just a few you know here this is just suggestions you can change a bit things here depending on your preference but again you can try the following settings so first let's discuss the luminance settings so the values for luminance uh set this to around 50 percent then brightness is around 100 percent now for echo mode i set this to standard and for the hr effect you can turn this off but again depending on your preference some people like this to uh, they like to turn this on or off but again depending on your preference so in my case i like to turn this off so that i can actually see the actual values and pictures that i see on my screen now for the gamma you can set this to three now for the color setup you could use the color temperature warm but then again, if you don't want to use the warm values, you could choose the following values, which is uh, for the red. You can set this to 96, green to 85, and blue to 90. But you can experiment with the values here. You can increase the greens and blues to balance things out. But if you want a cooler tone, you can increase the blues and decrease the reds and greens. Now, for the picture boost, uh, you can turn this feature up. And for the game settings, uh, this is actually entirely on your preference. So you can turn on certain settings and that can actually make the screen brighter and colors more vivid. And you could also test this out while gaming to see what works best for you. Now, just to give you some note here, some settings can make you dizzy. So make sure that you're really, uh, f uh, you're really sure with that specific uh, setting. But then again, start playing with the settings for this one. Now for other settings, you can leave this as is. You don't want to change other things here. But then again, every setting that I've just discussed here are just suggestions so you could try, but in this case, that's about it. So hopefully this video was able to help you like and subscribe to NFT Inspo. Thank you for watching.